Hi guys, welcome to another video. Today I've got for you a Acer Nitro 5, which has got an issue with uh, the screen. It's one of those days today, just a screen day today. Um, uh, I can actually see the cracks, you can see them there. I don't know if you can see the lines there, but there's, if I press down, you can see it, the actual machine's on uh, and it's absolutely battered. So the, the, the LCD is bleeding through. So we're going to go ahead now and uh, see what screen's in there and give the customer a quote and order accordingly. So first thing to do is get the bezel off. Um, I'm actually going to go from the inside this time. So this light's extremely bright. Um, so lift off from here slightly and the bezel will just pop off. Make sure, be careful, you don't want to break any of the, the clips that are on the outer side. Uh, you may break one or two here and there, but I won't worry about it. You can still bond stuff down if you have to, but no, that was a clean break. A clean removal, should I say, of the bezel. Um, the screen has one, two, three, four. It has got a frame. We don't need to remove the hinge hinges. They're not attached to the screen. So let's go ahead and uh, remove them. I'll use my uh, Chardon uh, screwdriver, uh, which you can um, buy from Amazon uh, from the link below. Click on that and you see uh, not just this, but some of the products that I use um, throughout the repairs, or, or, or I recommend some of these products um, that can make the job a lot easier. So I'm going to remove these screws. And we're going to lift the screen out like so and we'll reveal the connector so what you need to do now i'd recommend is just take uh i just had a one before it must have had a screen before because it's got sellotape on it so if someone's done this before by well, looks of it uh hasn't got a door on the connector uh, what you need to do is uh, just get on the edge of the edge of the connector and push away and that will come away uh, so the screen that we need to order for this one is a uh well there you go it's just there it's a optronics b156 h a n 0.6.1 i may have one in stock i'll check if i have then we can uh, put it in now uh, if not i'll have to order and uh, we'll continue the video at a later date all right guys the screen has arrived for the uh ata nitro 5 Let's take out the packet, make sure it's the correct screen. It should be a matte one, which it is, which is great. So I'm going to pick that off. There's a film on there for now, it's not going to bother us. Uh, the first thing I want to do is connect the screen. The connector, sorry, to the screen. Make sure it's a solid fit and uh, there is a bit of someone's put some tape on there but anyway uh, i'm just going to make sure it lines up correctly okay that the top of the frame is slightly bent and i have noticed one thing this hinge is actually broken on this side so uh, but i'm sure i think the chap's selling the machine anyway so i don't think he's going to bother bother uh, about that um i think you can see the whole screen yeah so th this bit was slightly bent uh probably bent in in, in transit transport um that's all good and let's power the device up there you go it's obviously been shut down uh, and restarted when the, the screen was was damaged so we put the oops I've got a tool on there uh, we put the uh, the screws back in now I'm going to use my shard and screwdriver today uh, which is magnetic as you can see 
and uh, it doesn't it comes with a magnetizer so if it's not you can magnetize them okay so we've got four screws to put back in and as you can see I'm gonna do a restart on that one actually okay that's in place now just to confirm that that is uh, the uh, correct display everything's working uh, fine it's hunky dory and all we need to do now is put the the bezel on which shouldn't take shouldn't take too long there you go so a another one bites the dust as they say so uh, let's put the bezel on. Get rid of the protective film for the screen. There you go. That is always a satisfying noise when you hear the clips doing their job yeah another job done thank you for watching and uh, see you on the next one